What's going on YouTube? It's been a while since I made a video. Um, I don't want to make this video too much of a rant. I don't want to make it too much of just me mumbling on. So, uh, Delve is my bread and butter League mechanic, right? Uh, minions, my bread and butter type of build, along with poison, but mainly minions, right? Um, I kind of have a gripe uh, with the state of the, the game right now. No shit, right? Yeah, most of the people do. But... I'm more of in a niche uh, compartment or department, I would say. Um, I like to delve a lot. I don't know too many people that enjoy delving so much. Um, delve is rough. Okay, I skipped 3.18. Uh, the last league I religiously kind of played was 3.17, and that's when Arch Nemesis was just a mechanic, right? It wasn't forced on every magic and rare. Now it's forced in every magic and rare. And I didn't consider that jumping into... Uh, delve this league I thought I was going to hit yellows I was going to hit reds spec into delve jump in spend an hour hour and a half in delve do four to six maps uh, and just repeat the cycle right that was the game loop and that's what I enjoy a lot of uh, problem is if we go to the list now the game depending on what level you're at it will put you in a fixi fixated like barrier uh uh a certain set of depth levels that you can start at right some people might start at 77 i started at 81 cool right as you can see i only went down one node um why did i only go down one node because i was realizing i was getting one shot quite a bit yes just delving one node i was getting screwed now i have 3200 health i'm a bug i'm gonna get squished quick but there are people that are getting screwed with way more defenses, way more health, way more beefier or way more beefy characters at yellow and reds, specifically reds. You're getting screwed. And the thing with Delve is, yes, I started out all the way down here. Monster level 78. I think that's like early reds. I think something like that. I, uh, I, I can't think or it's like late yellows, early reds, whatever that monster level uh, relates to map wise. I don't know. Um, I'm going off for three hours of sleep, so I apologize. But, um, yeah, this is the first time ever that I've just jumped into Delve, and I'm getting screwed just trying to progress, right? Typically, uh, in 3.17 and before, I would get into, like, early to mid stages of Atlas progression, jump into Delve to start making currency and just to f fund Atlas progression and just fly through gear upgrades. Um I can't do that. Arch Nemesis is... Uh, I didn't know it was going to be this buffed. I didn't know it was going to be this enhanced. Um, maybe it's worse than 3.18. Maybe they... I know they're toning it down a little bit, but the issue still stands. And, again, because I skipped 3.18, I, I got to, like, early yellows, and I just quit because Sentinel just didn't seem appealing to me, and I just didn't feel like really caring to uh dive into the mechanic itself so i just kind of gave up and just uh, started playing other games waiting for this league to start and it did well we are facing major issues uh me personally now again i don't want to make this a rant video i just want to be quick and precise yeah i've been farming t1 strand ess uh, essences I i've been farming essences on strand over and over religiously for like the past three days i've been spending anywhere from like eight to 14 hours a day uh doing this shit this is what's been making me divines i'm not doing it right now i'm not showing you gameplay because i just literally ran out of chaos before i recorded the video um yeah it's rough right now so where am i at currently mentally on my future progression in this game right me trying to map out what the hell I even want to do. What game loop do I want to partake in? Well, let's go through it real quick. Uh, Legion, yeah, good luck with carrying golems. Um, I do eventually want to tap into Poison Archers. I know Mages got screwed, but Poison Archers might low-key be the uh, Undertaker. It just might be able to revamp that same type of power and satisfaction I did with just whole screen clears, but with Poison and Archers. I think it'd be really cool. Um, so there's that, but for right now, Legion, no, Alva, no, uh, Bestiary, I'm good. I could do Heist. I love Heist. I actually think that the whole design of Heist and the whole 
thought process of that of what went into the mechanic is absolutely amazing. I hate doors. Enough, enough said. I might consider it, but I hate doors. Um, delve. I'm talking about that right now. Rip. Betrayal. Uh, I want to say in like 3.15, 3.14, or 3.16, something. Right before the Atlas, literally the league before the Atlas passive tree kicked in, um, I spent three hard weeks learning Betrayal uh, in and out. Right, I was super efficient, uh, at least to my standards. I was able to complete the layouts like three, four times a day. I was printing exalts. Cool. I was in the TFT Discord. Uh, everyone's got their opinion on it. I never scammed anyone. I never got scammed. Um, it wasn't a bad experience for me. Uh, and I was just making a lot of money. Atlas Passive Tree came out. I forget the nitty gritty. I forget all the details, but I just felt like Betrayal wasn't as... Uh, I'm not going to say profitable, but it just wasn't as consistent as what it was previously um, before the league drop. So I just kind of give up on that RIP. And yeah, so I'm, I'm kind of just sitting here thinking of mechanics that I could do. I would love to get into Blight. Blight requires a decent amount of investment, not so much in gear, uh, more on jewelry, anointments, and just knowledge on tower placement and just tower strategy, but really it's not that hard i did it a little bit in the past it was great but now with arch nemesis my goal is to be around like plus 10 positive 10 20 uh ideally maxed out chaos res but um with the arch nemesis mods and the poison explosions and the magma orb and everything it's not as afk as it used to be which is fine but it's a lot more rippy Ra Sir ravaged blight maps in general were already rippy now they're even more rippy as possible or than ever um which kind of sucks but i would like to dive into blight in the future we'll see about that but right now i'm just like sitting here thinking what am i what the hell am i gonna do after i'm sick of farming essences i'm not burnt out yet i'm not forcing myself to play the game i'm still enjoying it every day i'm making upgrades so that's cool that's that's satisfying but at the end of the day it's like well what mechanic what game loop am i going to want to really uh get into i could get into bossing but guess what that's going to take a lot more investment i probably put like five to ten divines into my build and i probably got 10 to 20 more to go before i could probably even clear t16s effortlessly without any juice so yeah um i got quite a long way to go and it's just, it's it's so sad, man. It's so sad because you never had this hardship in Delve before. Getting to depth 150, 200, 250, 300, if your build can kind of like out and go T16s pretty reliably with no issue, 300 is not that hard of a goal to achieve in Delve. It's not that hard. And right now, and you got to think, Delve is just nothing but tunnels, right? So when it comes to... Uh, situational awareness, positioning, all this stuff combined, uh, you're kind of limited. And on top of that, um, you're not going to be throwing flares down. So you're not going to be able to kill everything. And if you do what I do, typically I would just go to, you know, let's just pretend this is, you know, Delve 200. I would be hitting all of these. Like, here's a wall, here's a wall, here's a wall. Here's a wall. Here's a wall. Here's a wall. Here's two walls. Uh, here's a wall. Uh, here's a wall. Here, like I would be hitting all of these, and that's what that's that would be the top of my uh, um, prioritization, right? Like just hitting walls, and it was already low risk, low profit before which would net me anywhere from like again because i play minions i'm limited on movement speed nowadays it's not as giga chat op as it was uh from blight league and a couple leagues past that but it's it's severely nerfed movement speed wise um so i'm limited i uh between game knowledge pathing a little bit of rng just movement speed efficiency and everything um I was able to make like one to three, two to four exalts an hour. It's nothing crazy. To some, that's a lot. Others, that's a drop in the bucket. Whatever. I enjoyed it. I was making profit. I was able to fund builds. I was happy, right? At the end of the day, that's all that matters. As long as you're having a, a good time. Um, 
now I actually seriously considered, as you could see a little bit, and I'm talking like, dude, we are, we are far up. Like we look at the grand scheme of things, I'm less than halfway. I'm like a quarter way down and I'm delving and it's just, it's not as good. It's just not as good. Like you are severely limited on resonator drops and fossil drops and a combination of both and the quantity of what they drop. When you hit around 250, 300 to 225 to 300, um, you get a lot of resonators you get a lot of fossils, a lot more. The, the chances of fossils and resonators even spawning are higher. Um, it's just all around a net positive. And let's just say on average, you're able to see like two, three resonator chests, like every other wall, damn near. Now it's like one to two and they only drop like one to two, maybe three resonators before they would drop like five, six, seven so forth you know what i mean per chest sometimes so you can get really lucky sometimes it was kind of a dry run whatever but it was still pretty damn um uh self-sufficient just overall net positive so yeah i don't really want to get into a rant i don't want to mumble on um i just wanted to make this video kind of quick but yeah i'm i'm kind of stuck right now because after i'm done with essence farming and with crafting being gone i don't even know if essence farming is really going to be dead all the way through the league uh because i know it's more of an early game type of thing besides a couple niche essences that are kind of sold majority uh majority throughout the league um with harvest being extremely gutted and uh recombinators if that's how you pronounce it completely gone except in standard um people just have to resort to fossils and essences in general they just have to resort to them um get a fractured item slam it with a couple essences or fossils and whatever and just work with what you got now an interesting thing i don't know if this is due to popularity decreasing or something but take a look at this prime four socket resonators are 12 to 18 c that is insane uh every league that i've played it's been at least 30 that i've noticed 30 to 40 45 absolutely insane these are dirt cheap so it's not even really worth farming those essentially like it's insane i don't know why my game's all choppy right now i, I gotta restart the instance um but yeah so low depth horizontal bound or uh, uh fossil and low tier specifically primitive single socket resonators are like that's the that that's the that's the money right there you get a sh shit ton of them you get a shit ton of them and you just sell a couple big bulk stacks and there's your exalt or two or whatever you know what i mean so yeah i'm just sitting here thinking what the hell am i gonna do and if i end up giving uh poison archers a shot and seeing what the difference is in gameplay and clear ability and or clear speed and everything um if it's awesome cool i'll stick with it maybe i'll play the league a little bit more if it sucks and whatever or whatever the case may be that sucks uh but yeah i don't know maybe within a month i, I wanted to stick this league out at least for two a month and a half two months um we, we gotta see uh it doesn't look like anything's getting reverted this is the vision of what ggg has in, uh, in store for us I, I read the whole, uh, the, the seven day, six day blog post. Um, it's the 26th right now. So w whatever the title was for that post that just came out in the morning, it, it doesn't look like anything's really getting reverted. It's kind of here to stay with a cup with tweaks to come, but, um, yeah, between arch nemesis, the loot, a lot of mechanics just not really being too viable for me right now uh yeah i might just have to load up diablo 2 resurrected so it's unfortunate i hope you guys are having a better time than me i'm sticking it out i'm still having somewhat fun but yeah i, I think the longevity of this league is going to be shorter than i expected so i have no closer until i make another video which hopefully is going to be soon I, I i keep saying i'm going to be more consistent but i'm just 
I game, spend time with my girl, I hang out with friends. It's just whatever. It's usually on the back of my mind. But with that being said, I hope you guys are having a better time. I have no closer, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.